Hey guys, Don here. We're going to get another beer review. This time we have an IPA from Steamworks. And this is their Jasmine IPA. A strong beer at 6.5%. Now they make some really cool, uh, I don't know if they're, uh, Silk screened or there, but anyways, they always make cool bottles. It's got a Japanese theme on it, or Asian theme, I guess. Some of it. So, anyways, yeah, this is a your Jasmine IPA. Malts, Maris, Maris Otter, Caramalt. And Munich hops are Bramling Cross, Celia, and Centennial. Never heard of Bramling Cross before. And what unique in it? Jasmine flowers, color golden, IBU 60. Yeah, cool. Anyway, something new again. That just got here. Skunky, but we're gonna have this out of a glass from uh, probably one of my favorite breweries so far, all time. Local brewery, Ham River Brewing from Quiz Pam, New Brunswick. It's just out of Quiz Pam, I guess. It's outside. I think it's outside, outside Quiz Pam, but. Anyways. Of course, I got a freaking crud on the glass. Why wouldn't I? That's yeah, on the outside. I can live with that. Anyways, we'll give it a pour. Non dirty side, maybe. Now, this is a 6.5. Very light looking uh, IPA and a strong head. Little legs on her, but yeah, it almost looks like a Pilsner or a lager. Anyways, give it a smell. Yeah, it's got a weird, uh, it's got a real heavy, earthy hop uh, aroma to it right off the bat. It's almost like a, it's got a real, real hop stink. I don't know, you know, by hop stink, you know, it's really earthy, off kind of, uh, well, smelly kind of thing going on. Anyways, a little citrus in there, a little orange. But I'm getting almost a, uh, There is a light sugary caramel smell in there, chocolate kind of thing going on. Go to the taste. Floralness is there. No doubt about it. New no dude about it. Yeah, it's almost too floral for me. I say floral the first time. Floral. Uh, and Chris Collier, if you see this, this is definitely one of those beers you're talking about. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know.
very light beer. Not a lot of uh, for six month five. There's not a lot, not a big taste, lot, or a lot of big taste there. But yeah, I don't know. That's a nice little uh, lemony flavor in there. But the uh, you know, the floral jasmine is in there, which is. Yeah, great for a hop head if you like this stuff. I mean, I know hop heads always do like that stuff, so, but... Oh! This one might take me a while to get through, but... This is a very, really nice bottles. Steam brewing opens the gates of possibility. Steam beer has heritage. When the steam's historic... And I suppose that's more most the uh, Steamworks beer steam. That's when they like steam all their beer. Steam brewing, I guess. Barley malt, barley malt, hops, yeast, mm. water. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, it's not one really blowing me away. It's going to take me probably forever to drink it. I don't know, we'll go with 2.75 and it's not pass. It's uh you know, it's drinkable. It's just not one not something for me really. Um Yeah, I don't know, it's okay. 2.75. These guys seen a bit.